There's a windmill carved into the wood. There's a windmill carved into the wood. What was that sound? There's a windmill carved into the wood. There's a windmill carved into the wood.
There's someone in there. Frederick Ager. to pin the hidden documents. empty photo album. Has someone been here?
I feel somebody watching me from the darkness. I should investigate. I feel somebody watching me from the darkness. I should investigate. Mr. Hardacre, you're a hard man to follow. I nearly lost you. Not interested. I brought you here for a reason, and one reason only. I want you to leave Saxton at your first convenience and never come back. What? Now look here. You can't order people about. I'm no threat to you, like you pointed out. I know nothing about geology or archaeology. That's not the half of it. There's mystery and danger involved. You know nothing about this town or the land around us. So, is that a crime? It takes skill, understanding and a strong mind to find what's hidden out there in the fens. It's an old land which can be unforgiving to those who blunder in with their eyes closed and their chins wagging. Danger? What danger? It's as I thought. You know nothing yet. Are you threatening me, Mr. Hardacre? No, you fool. I'm trying to warn you. Take that cottage, harbour cottage, that you'll be staying in. Know much about it, do you? You know I don't. It's a small place, a bit stuffy, but nice enough. Listen out, tonight, as you're drifting into sleep. Listen for the sounds. Sounds? What sounds? Are you saying the cottage is haunted? You'll know soon enough. They always do. An old land? Some parts of our land have seen great things. Others have seen murder, disease, and disaster. If you look close enough, you can see the signs. A landscape can seem empty and desolate when the sun sets low and the wind chills the blood. But the land is never empty. It echoes with the voices of those that have gone before. Pagan warrior kings, great gods, and fearsome beasts. Keep your eyes and ears open, and you'll know 
soon enough. What are the Fanes? An ancient world of murky waters and whispering leaves. They surround us on all sides, trapping us here, so to speak. Take a walk tomorrow morning out across the shore, through the Fenland Eye. The Fens will be waiting, like those who dwell there. They are always waiting. Where is the treasure? Oh dear, oh dear. You didn't really think it would be that easy, did you? Things that are lost are waiting to be found. But what of those precious items that have been hidden? Stashed away, for good reason. Should we go looking for treasures we are not supposed to find? You are talking nonsense, Mr. Hardacre. Nonsense, is it? Well, we shall see. Watch your back, Danvers. Not everyone in this town is as accommodating as myself. There are those who won't take too kindly to you digging up what should lay buried. That's enough questions, Danvers. If you insist on staying, think on what I have said. But just a lad, be careful what you go looking for. Good night. Good night, Mr. Hardacre. No business walking the shore in the dark tonight. Hmm, what's this? Hello again. What can I get you? Is May a busy time for Saxton? Yes, you could say that. Local events? The Saxton May Day Fair is famous in these parts. You'll be in for quite a week. Does the pub have a phone? Afraid not. Wouldn't be in keeping with the place. Is there a payphone in town? Yes, across the harbour, over the bridge and up Station Lane. I'll catch you later. Perhaps.
That's not right. I thought I heard voices. That's unusual. The clock is stuck at nine o'clock. Hello up there. Oh, good evening to you. What are you doing? Fixing this here bunting to the buildings. Why? Is there a celebration due? Where are you being hiding? There's May Day round the corner. Saxton's a quiet town. Oh, well, if you say so. Could you fix the electricity at Harbour Cottage? Gone again, is it? Damn wiring. Is that a no? Hey, for now. Sorry, lad. I'll let you get on. Maybe I'll come quicker that way. Find a phone box, a phone handle, time to make amends. Thank <laughs> you. 
closed. Fine for that, you know. Excuse me? Pasting posters? Fly posters? It's illegal, isn't it? I have no idea. Is there something you want? Are you lost? Actually, I have something of yours. Oh, really? And what's that? Your wallet. Here, take it. Oh, um, thanks. I didn't mean to snap. So, what's the poster for? Take a look. Hmm, Reuben's Fair. Huh. Oh dear, are the freaks coming to town? You could say that. I'm Nigel, by the way. Nigel Danvers? I'm Lucy. Lucy Reuben's. Ah, uh, I see. Part of the fair? Yep, I'm one of the freaks. I didn't mean to offend you. Too late. I saw you out in the uh, reed beds. You mean the fens? Fens? What's the origin? It's Anglo-Saxon. For swamp, or marsh, or bog. Quagmire, perhaps? Same to you too. Oh, a comedian. So, are you local? I was, but I only returned for the holidays. You must know the surrounding area very well. Not really. I tend to stay in town. I have my studies. Ah, what are you studying? Psychology. Really? So what do you make of me? You are desperate, insecure, and seeking phantom treasures. How did you know that? 
Ah, pretty obvious, is it? Uh huh. I'll leave you to um, paste your posters. See you around, sunshine. something to say, to make a deal. My dear Mr. Danvers, what could you possibly offer? Haddon? Speaking? Is there something you want to say? Leave me alone. I didn't see anything. So call off your dogs. Mr. Hare and Mr. Crow have your welfare in mind, Nigel. Well, they won't find me. I've left the city. Yes. How are you finding Saxton so far? That phone box looks a little, uh, old-fashioned. What? How did you... Are you still spying on me? Oh, Nigel. That's a little rich, coming from you. I didn't intend to hack your files. Like you didn't intend to print off some copy. What is that stuff, anyway? The future, dear boy. And the past. We have the technology, as you know. What do you want from me, Mr. Hatton? Nothing and everything. A few little tasks. Involving the paranormal. I'm not a lab rat, Hatton. That's exactly what you are, Nigel. A rat in a trap. Help us with our research. You won't go unrewarded. Where are Hare and Crow? They've lost your scent, Nigel. You need not worry. Tell me about the research. Ah, I knew you'd show an interest. You can help us, Nigel. I'm not a scientist, Haddon, nor a ghost hunter. Paranormal research can require very little, Nigel. I have nothing except the clothes that I stand in. Scrying. I beg your pardon? Scrying is an ancient art. You only need water and a mirror. What do I do? Is it dangerous? It can be. Pour the water down the mirror and watch. And wait. You may be surprised by the results. We often are. We? You practice this scrying in the lab. Yes, with amazing results. Just believe and look deeply. The ghost hunters of old showed great ingenuity. How do you know where I am? I know everything about you, Nigel. How comforting. What happens next? Await my gift. It was dispatched this afternoon. How did you know where, uh... Where you'd stay, like I said. You know everything. What's the gift? You will see. Not all, 
is as it seems. Keep that in mind. These experiments, am I in any danger? Would you like me to lie? No, but uh, I've always suspected that... Life should be more interesting, more exciting. I hate my job. I'd do anything to get away. This could be your big break, Nigel. I see you as... How can I put this? A little bit of an investment. So, I'm forgiven for snooping. Curiosity and ingenuity should be rewarded. Good night, Mr. Haddon. Good night, Mr. Danvers. Good hunting. You can be fine for that, you know. I'll leave you to, um, paste your posters. See you around, sunshine. Hello up there. Oh, good evening to you. Could you fix the electricity at Harbour Cottage? Gone again, is it? Damn wiring. Is that a no? Hey, for now. Sorry, lad. I'll let you get on. Maybe it'll come quicker that way. ventured.
Is there anybody there? Can you see me? What's your name? Can I help you in some way? Is there something you want to tell me? Am I... am I in danger? Can you hear me? Hmm. Nothing. The event seems to have passed. Is there anybody there? A 
Am I alone in this place? Show me you are here. Are you trapped in this place? Can I help you in some way? What's your name? Is there something you want to tell me? Hmm, nothing. The event seems to have passed for now. Can I help you in some way? I shall leave you in peace. Hmm, nothing. The event seems to have passed for now. ventured. Thank you. 
Frederick Ager. An empty photo album. That's not right. That's not right. day in Saxton. Well, another day in Saxton, at least. <laughs> 